In this video, we present few short panoplic segmentation with foundation models and provide additional qualitative results for both public and in-house data. We motivate our work with two key observations. First, most previous methods for panoptic segmentation rely on fully supervised training strategies, requiring a huge number of annotated images. Obtaining these labels is both expensive and time-consuming. Second, inspired by the foundation model seen in natural language processing, the vision community has produced similar methods, such as CLIP, Segment Anything, or Dino. As a consequence, some recent works exploit these visual foundation models for unsupervised semantic segmentation. However, their performance remains inferior to fully supervised approaches. Therefore, we argue that it's time for a paradigm shift. We propose to combine task agnostic pre-training from unsupervised foundation models with very few expert annotations. Our proposed future panoptic segmentation method significantly outperforms prior unsupervised methods by leveraging only 10 annotated images. In our method Spino, we leverage visual features from a large foundation model that is trained only with RGB images. In a given domain, we send 10 images to an expert annotator and train our pseudo label generator. For the remaining images, we create high quality panoptic pseudo labels in an offline manner. Finally, we can train any existing panoptic segmentation model with these pseudo labels to allow real time inference and further boost segmentation quality. The key idea of our pseudo label generator is to exploit Dino V2 image features for two downstream tasks. We perform semantic segmentation with an N class MLP and estimate object boundaries using a binary classifier. Finally, we fuse the output of both modules to obtain the overall panoptic pseudo label. In these videos, we visualize our panoptic pseudo labels for both Cityscapes and KT360. Please note, that we used only 10 annotated images to train our entire framework, including the Dino V2 backbone and the task-specific heads of our panoptic pseudo-label generator. Finally, we demonstrate general applicability to different robotic platforms by showing qualitative results on two in-house data sources. For these, we again obtained annotations for only 10 images in each domain. We strongly believe that our proposed method underlines the potential of leveraging unsupervised foundation models for future learning in the image domain. To foster future research, we will release our code on the project website. Thank you for your attention.